Hi guys, welcome to Saturday. Saturday. Saturday, Chris is day off, that's why he's here and it's like 9 or 10 a.m. And yeah. I'm sticking petroleum jelly on my forehead. And I've already got something else on her face. Yeah, I have a an avocado and oatmeal clay mask on my face apparently. So, the reason I'm sticking petroleum jelly on my face is so I don't dye my head purple. Actually red, but it's like a pinky red because I'm, I'm dyeing my hair. Finally. I've been talking about doing this for months, but we didn't want to do it right before the wedding because in case I didn't like it and then my hair would be red for the for our wedding, wedding pictures. Yeah. yeah, what did we ever talk about on the vlog that you wanted to dye your hair? I don't know if we did. I don't think we did. But she used to have red hair. I did. For I liked, a little while. I liked it. It's semi permanent dye, but since I don't ever wash my hair, it's permanent dye for me. That rinses out faster. So, yeah, I'm putting together this dye. I don't know if the texture has changed at all because it's really old. So I'm hoping all my hair doesn't fall off. So I'm using the Adore brand. I don't know. It's just what my local hair place had when I was a, a teen first wanting to dye their hair. My dad hates my hair this color and my mom loves it. So when I was 17 and dyed my hair this color, she was great with it, and my dad was like, ugh, I hate it so much. But, I like it. So I like it from pictures. I'm really excited to see what it looks like in person. I'm going to wear these gloves so my hands aren't red. That would be nice. So I'm, us I'm using crimson and paprika to get the right color. That was actually, I think, my mom's idea. She's like, if you want it a little, a little less pink, you can add the paprika in. I think this is a good color. It's really hard to tell. Yeah, I feel it's a little brown, so I'm not going to put any more paprika in for sure. So yeah, it's good. And so I'm multitasking with my mask. and Yeah, so basically you just put it on your hair, and then you stick a plastic bag on your head, or any plastic cap, but that's all I have, and then you blow dry your hair for like 15 minutes, but I'm going to do 30 just so it can set in better. The first time I did it, I only did a very light wash, like very, very light. And I loved it, and but my mom was like, just in case for the end of school, like we don't want you to do it. And I was like, okay, fine. So I just did a very light wash, and then after that, I like went ham and dyed my hair like bright red, and it was the best thing ever. So. Do you have some uh, booktube videos with your red hair? Yeah, that's when I hadn't dyed it for a few months, I think. I'm pretty sure. So you started booktube with red hair. Yes, I did. <laughs> Because I had dyed it a few months before that, and it was still in there. So, now I'm going to go put this on my hand. And now it's time to blow dry. This is Christopher's blow dryer. From when I had long hair. I've never owned a blow dryer <laughs> or a straight iron. And Christopher owns both. <laughs> For my long hair, yeah. <laughs> Red hair. How do you feel about it? You like I it? I like it. Yeah, it's fun. I like it a lot too. It is kind of magenta-y. It is. That's okay. I do have a little bit left of this paprika, so I can always stick a little bit more of this in and re-dye it in a few days or in a week or two, and tone it down a little bit and touch up my roots at the same time. Yeah. So that might be an idea. And we're at our new apartment. I just want to kind of give a quick preview of what it looks like. This is the living room, so that's where a couch can go. There's plenty of room for books and my workout stuff and bookcases and... Sorry, it's kind of dizzy. It's really cool in here. There's a closet. There's a... Wait, hold on one second. There's a graveyard right out there. Awesome. There's a closet for coats and utility stuff. And then there's the kitchen, which is huge. It's a huge kitchen. There's a space for a kitchen table right over there. Plus maybe... My parents are keeping a piano for us at their house. And we might be able to put it like right there. It's like perfect size for that. And more counter space. There's the bathroom. It's all cool looking in there. The bathroom is pretty nice. 
And we have a storage room right here. This is going to be like food storage, like food storage shelves. I'm getting more shelves from work, like the one I got from that one time. Bathroom. This is going to be my little office slash just computer area space. Maybe we can put some another bookshelf in here and some more stuff in here. And there's this little storage thing here. Like I said, just a preview. More books. More books for this. Possibly. And then our bedroom is in here. It has lights, it has tons of windows, it's really beautiful. I'm really excited to live here. There's two closets, two big closets. Well, <laughs> two. they're not big. Well, they're closets. Together, they're big. Yes. There's even a light in the closet, it's so cute. Except for it's burnt out. That's okay, we'll fix that. And there's like shoe storage things right here. There's, yeah, there's shoe storage things right here. That's and there's really cool. lots of bars and so. Yeah. That would be better. This place is only $100 more than what we're paying right now for the tiny little space that we have there. This place is huge. I am so in love with this place. Yeah, I have no he, idea. He mentioned that some other people made an offer, I guess, after we came here. They made an offer, like, not for like 100 more than what we were paying. Yeah, they, they were going to pay $100 more than we, that he told us that we had, like we had to pay. Deal, but yeah. he was like, you guys seem normal, so we'd rather have you. Yeah. Which is awesome. Surprise! My hair is still red, which is not a surprise for you because you just saw me. But every time, every I... time either of us looks at it, we're like, "Whoa!" Whoa! My hair is red. Every time I walk past a mirror, I'm like, oh, "This is awesome!" And then Chris keeps looking at me and being like, "Your hair is so cool!" Like every time he looks at me, and I'm like, "I'm guessing it's because he keeps forgetting that it's red." And then yeah, I've just I've never seen her with red hair before. Like it's besides fun. in a picture, I need to so wash it again. So it's it got really used to. It being not red, now it's red, so yeah. it's weird. I need to wash it again, but I just i have been too lazy to take a third shower for the day. I'm just done. Yeah. Because I took a shower, I'd like a full shower, and then I washed my hair again to rinse the color out, and I'm like, mm -hmm. I'm not taking a third one to <laughs> rinse it out again, like more fully in the bath. So maybe tomorrow. Yeah. We'll see. Maybe after church. It'll be fun going to church tomorrow. Yeah, I don't, really I don't have to teach, which is... Yeah. Uh, Oh, so great. So yeah. we went to a bookstore earlier just to like check it out because yeah. it was like on our way. It was a really expensive place. But it, it was called Barely Red Books. So I mean, it it's not cool that looking. expensive. I think it's about typical for I mean, a for, used bookstore. I guess. I just like, when I go into a bookstore like that, I'm just like, I'm never going to buy anything from a place like this. Because it's, there's so many other places to buy I stuff would from. if it was like a book I was specifically looking for. Yeah, maybe. Like, if it's like, I'm going to buy this off of Amazon for, like, a barely, bar barely discounted price anyway, yeah. I would okay. buy it there. And we also went to well, Stop and Shop. Yeah. Yeah. We were, I almost said Walmart. We didn't go to Walmart. Yeah. We went to the store, and then we also... It was funny, because I was like, hey, let's stop by the Dollar Tree. And then one of our grocery items that we'd forgotten to get from the actual grocery store... We, we got from the Dollar Tree. Yeah, so it was perfect. We remembered it last minute. This was this was all around the new apartment area, by the way. We all went, we like went and kind of explored around that area a little bit, and went to the stores around that area because those are the stores we're going to be going to once we move. So like the Stop and Shop, the Walmart. There's a Target over there. There's Dollar Tree over there. So we're never gonna have to come back over here again, which we're very excited about. Yes, I mean because we hate the roads over here. The Dollar lot. Tree coming to the Dollar Tree over here just wouldn't be worth it, honestly. Oh yeah, I mean there's so. one right there, so. Yeah, so anyway, we explored a bit, and it was very fun, and we went into the grocery store, and we grabbed everything we needed and wanted. We didn't get one thing that wasn't on our list, and I was very proud of us. Me too. I didn't get distracted by donuts, even though they were buy one, get one free. So. Were they? I'm glad I didn't see that. <laughs> <laughs> this is our problem, just so many good sales, and we're like, I need that when we don't, so. We're trying very hard not to spend a lot of money right now, yeah, so. We're being adults, okay. so. And as I said that, I bought a book at the Dollar Tree. It was a dollar, though. Yeah. At the Dollar Tree. Yeah. It's like, what are you going to find? A brand new hardback for a dollar anywhere except for the Dollar Tree. Nowhere, so. Yeah. Anyway, and since we've been home, I've just been a lazy bum, and Chris has been looking at stuff online and doing stuff. And well, like, we, we did like a couple applications for places for her to work at and stuff like that, so. Yeah. I so mean, you did stuff. But like 90% of it was Chris. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> he, like, filled it all out and then was like, Well, no. Okay, you need to come take your quiz now. And I was like, okay, I'll take the quiz. But he, like, filled out all my past work <laughs> opportunities and jobs and stuff like that. He has, like, all my information memorized. <laughs> Good thing I'm married to him because otherwise I'd be creepy. 
<laughs> so yeah, that's what we did, and I've just been watching videos online, like a hobo. Yeah, me too. I don't know why we're standing so far away from each other. <gasps> Ah, and yeah. our, my hair with your shirt is Christmas. It is. So, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, we, we, it's been a lazy day. I just, I feel... <laughs> gonna ignore that happened. <laughs> we, I, I really just feel lost without being able to edit vlogs yet. So. <laughs> Starting to do his life. And about five times today, he said, just up. Can we just oh, pack yeah. up and leave right now? Can we just leave right now? I hate I, this apartment so much. Let's leave. Let's just pack I, right now and move. And I'm like, Chris, I, you don't have anywhere to I, move Ever into. since we saw the apartment and gave, like, our first month's rent to this guy for uh, starting in August, we, I just, I need to move. Like, I love that place. I love that apartment. I love everything about it. And I want to move right this very second. Yeah. So coming great. into this, coming into this place when we, when we got back earlier, I was just like, can we leave? I'm like, so let's just sad. leave right now. Because like, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I can't wait. So, anyway, yeah. I think that's pretty much it for today, though. Thanks for watching. Today's exciting. Giselle dyed her hair, and we saw the apartment again, and it was awesome. And got to actually show you guys. And Can't wait to move stuff in, and then you guys can see what it looks like. We'll actually be able to do an apartment tour, because it won't be a mess 100% of the time, because we can actually put things places. Yeah, it'll be nice. A place yeah. for everything, and everything in its place. Exactly. As my mother would say. I'll see you guys tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow.